Anyways, um, I decided to do something that's, um, based off the Inspector Gadget series, um, or at least the Inspector Gadget, uh, 2015 reboot that, um, has, a uh, um, that, that's on Netflix, because I, I really liked it lately, and I decided to kind of have a series based off it, maybe, why not, I mean... Anyways, I have the characters, or at least the characters that are usually at the... Of course, we have Inspector Gadget, of course, because the series. And we have um, Penny, which is Inspector Gadget's niece, which... Um, if you've seen the series, the original, the others, the... Or, like I said, the one on Netflix. You know who these characters are. Um, but, yeah. Inspector Gadget is, like, half cyborg. And he's just, like, full of gadgets. Uh, you know what I mean. Um, if you've seen the series, you know. Apparently he's playing with this little toy robot. I don't really know where it came from. I actually, um... This house is not something I built. I got it off the gallery because I didn't really feel like building anything. So I'll go ahead and show you who built that really quick. Um, I actually got... Oh, spoiler alert. Um, <laughs> I should upload those after the video. Um, oh, yeah. Uh, it's this one. It's by, uh, Current. I'm not really sure if, how to pronounce, if that's how you pronounce the username, but, um, yeah, I think it's a really good build, and how do I go to the original? Well, but anyways, it, the, the, Title of the the thing I downloaded by Current is Embrace the Green Mansion or something. I know I really didn't try to have it as a mansion. As rather I just had it kind of like the little police area because I thought it was like kind of like that. What I looked up was a secret agent. So yeah. I speaking of that. Um, as I was talking about the character, sorry, I went all over the place. Anyways, I talked about how we got Inspector Gadget and his niece Penny. Um, I also have the other characters in the show, like here's Chief Quemby, um, is the chief, of course. And Professor Von Sixteen, which is their scientist. Um, uh, and then Kayla, which is Penny's friend who's also, um, a junior agent in HQ. I also had Chief Quimby, um, have their thing as a club. I just noticed I forgot to add other things to the club, but oh well. Um, Mad is out there too. Um, it's... I've, there's only two members, but, um, yeah, Dr. Claw is out there, and so is Talon. Um, Talon is in the Inspector Gadget 2015 reboot, and is, I love interest of Penny, and is the nephew of Dr. Claw. Um, yeah. Um, I also downloaded, downloaded a place for them Sorry, whoops. Um, I also downloaded something off the gallery for them. I also kind of edited this thing a bit. Um, just needed to, like, put brain stuff down and make a kid's room more of a teen room for since we have two teens. Which reminds me, I need a... Uh, um, uh, of this character pen and 
Um, let's just have them all adopt the teens as care dependent because why not? Um, since we don't really have any parents around, um, let me go ahead. I don't know. I mean, I guess they shouldn't be Quimby's and Quimby and um, uh, Professor Von Sixteen, Chief Quimby and Professor Von Sixteen, since they're not they're not their kids. Or but um, there's no parents for Kayla, so it, well, I don't know. They need somebody as a care dependent, so I don't know. So that's just what you're doing, and I guess we just... What I do for this is that, like, if, like, Mad is causing any problems, and sometimes we'll play as Mad, um, aka we'll play as Dr. Claw and um, Talon, it was a hard time trying to figure out how to hide Dr. Claw's face. I made him, like, super tall. You can't see it right now because we're not in that. Maybe I'll switch over to them um, to show you. But, like, I put on, like, something from Get Famous that kind of looked like the mad symbol, but not really. Um, kind of mask on him. I also... I made him look like the action figure. I don't know. You know, the one that has the, his actual face reveal. But I don't know if that's actually canon or not. But I made it look like that but underneath. But I also had the mask to hide him. But, um, uh, but I think if we ever do play, which we will play as, like... Dr. Claw and Talon and any other mad agents is that, um, sorry, I say um a lot. Whoops. Um, okay, why did I do that? All right. Um, <laughs> anyways, as I was trying to say, is that if we do play as, as Dr. Claw and Talon, is I'll try to hide his place, maybe play in first person mode. Um, and yeah, I'll try to hide his face or mask or whatever we're going to do. If, I did try Grim Reaper at first, but it didn't really exactly hide his face. It just hid the back of his head. Um, but yeah. But like I said. <laughs> but right now, like I said, we're just like we'll play as um the Inspector Gadget the uh, whatever eh, Inspector Gadget HQ um that's why I had them as a club as that well I do have Inspector Gadget in the police career and I have Quimby uh, Chief Quimby in the police police career he's not gonna be chief obviously because um it not unless we cheated it then he could be chief but I just thought that if there was a club then these guys could participate as um junior eight junior agents um because they're teenagers and yeah <laughs> Um, and Professor Von Sixteen isn't in the police career, but is a um, scientist because he is a scientist, which makes me want to ask, I don't know if Dr. Claw should be in the criminal career or the scientist career because he's Dr. Claw and we don't really have, well, here comes the pun, a mad scientist. Um, so... Unless we use one of the scientists in the show, I don't know. I did actually created these characters off screen. Sometimes I play off screen just like for fun. Sometimes this is what this is why these guys are are already made. Is um yeah. I also made the cuckoo clock caper one time. 
um, off screen screen. So I don't know if he counts as a mad scientist or not, but maybe we could use him, but I'm not really sure we could use somebody else. But I know I keep talking about how the other characters when I'm supposed to look at um HQ um aka Inspector Gadget the main characters the good the the protagonists. Um but yeah, that's why they're in the club and everything. And yeah. I was also meaning they are complaining because there is clear sky. Okay. All right. I should probably have everyone claim their beds. Let's see. Well, there's brain. I made him, like, a mix. I forgot. There was, like, a... It said what breed he was on the wiki, and, um... It was, like, a mixed breed. I forget. It was Beagle, or maybe it wasn't Beagle. It was either Beagle mixed with something, and I don't know, and this came out. He's really tiny, and I know he's not that short in the show, but... I just thought, well, why not? Um, maybe I should go ahead and switch and see, and show, I uh, not see, show you what I did for, um, our antagonist, Dr. Claw and Talon. Um, see everyone, um, what everyone's doing. Okay. Oh, I should show you their traits. Um... Inspector Gadget wants to be friend of the world, and he um he's a child he's childish, goofball, and clumsy. Um, Chief Quimby um wants to be a bodybuilder. Supposed to go with the police thing, but I'm not really sure. I I don't know. <laughs> Tell me if I don't know if that. But I just thought I went with the police thing. And he is ambitious, good, and hot-headed. Um, and Professor Von Sixteen is a nerd. His aspiration is nerd brain. And he's a bookworm, genius, and good. And we got Kayla, who's a geek and outgoing. And she wants to be friend of the world. And then there's Penny, who is a nerd brain. And she is genius and af um, not athletic, <laughs> active. Um, but yeah, that's what I got for them. I should have clicked and showed you the characters. Um, whoops. So I guess... That that's how I introduce them for now. Um, I think I'll go ahead and introduce the Mad Sims or the antagonist. Um, Okay, my timer on my phone is still there. That's good. Um, I set it to 30 minutes because one time I recorded and it just... It was too much time. I think maybe I should have went for an hour... I think I just, like, recorded it for a whole day, and that was a big mistake of mine. <laughs> um, I was trying to do some things in first person, but I end up, um, 
messing up in the end because it was a whole day. <laughs> um, so I'm trying to be more time manageable because I can't edit these that well because I'm not, I don't really know how to edit that well. So not yet, at least. Um, but I'm trying. So, yeah. Believe me, if I knew how to edit, I would probably edit this loading stuff out. I hope we were were able to see the mad ones. Okay, there we go. <laughs> So we opened on town, so that's good. Um, sorry, my video's covering the spot. I don't know why it won't. Um, okay. So this is Talon. Um, can't, I tried, well, I thought, I guess this hoodie would fit the best for what his outfit kind of looks like in the show. And yeah, that's Talon. Um, and his aspiration is to be the chief of mischief. And he's evil and self-absorbed. I didn't know whether to do him as self-assured or self-absorbed. I had him as self-assured in the past, but I thought self-absorbed would really fit because, well, it just, I just think it fits because he is pretty self-absorbed. No? <laughs> um, and then there's Dr. Claw here. Let's do it. Well, that's the mask thing I was talking about. Um, uh-oh. Okay. I was hoping it wasn't going to freeze. I'm going to do first person, maybe, to do it this way. Anyways, yeah. I added the get famous jewelry thing. I thought it fit with the claw thing, but I'm not really sure. <laughs> um... His aspiration is public enemy, which he will need the criminal career if we do the criminal career, which I think we want to do the criminal career, but like I said, I'm not really sure if I'm going to do that. And his traits are evil, cat lover, and hot-headed. And the club is mad. Um... And Talon's in it. I don't have anybody else yet. I do plan to add maybe Malicious and, like I said, the Cuckoo Clock Caper. Um, but I'll think on that. Um, oh, I didn't see what show you what HQ does. But um, Med, Swipes, Objects, Hacks, and Sabotage Objects. I don't know why it's not coming up. And these mischievous to everyone. I think I want to go ahead and change that and still be mischievous, but be mischievous clubs uh, HQ. And I don't know how this is going to affect Talani in any way because, but Talani the ship because, uh, 
but probably would want to do that is be mean to HQ. Um, I guess we could work through it. Because I do want to have a bit of Talani in this let's play because I like Talani. Pretty nice ship. Oh yeah, and then there's Mad Cat. I didn't really properly I mean I looked at Brain, but yeah. Anyways, here's Mad Cat. Oh, I forgot to show you. I know. I'll, I'll show you the evil lair, whatever the heck it is, um, that I downloaded from the gallery later. But hold on. This is Mad Cat, because I was going to introduce Mad Cat. Um, this is Mad Cat. She's, uh,. I guess I gotta look at her this way. Um, she is talkative, mischievous, and spoiled. I thought that that would fit. And she also has a second outfit. Um, this is actually, I've seen this in like the titles of episodes before is that she has like a spiked collar of uh, well of episodes of inspector gadget 2015 reboot is that she has a spiked collar and a bow and i think she did have it on on one episode but i can't really remember which it was but anyways i just thought it was a nice little feature i'm gonna go ahead and take it off now And yeah, so this is what Mad is, um, <laughs> what, what the antagonists look like, uh, Dr. Claw and Dr. Claw and Talon. Um, that doesn't work. Okay. Okay, okay there we go. The wall was like not showing up for some reason. I think it's because I didn't have the wall on. Um, and I downloaded this evil lair thing. I mean, yeah, it's Future Labs, Future Science Lab 2 um, by Sheena27. Um, and I looked in a hashtag, I was looking for like mad scientist or something. Um, I thought, yeah, that's pretty good. I also edited this as well, like, for Mad Cat's items. But I also edited, like, in this little bedroom area, which will probably be Dr. Claus. Um, like, their little living room area where they kind of hang out. And there's, like, the throne kind of thingy that's not throne, but, or chair, whatever Dr. Claus sits in. And the couch, and there's a video game system, because I just thought it was kind of like that. Um, it probably doesn't look exactly like it. Again, I would like to build maybe, like, the Mad Lair or something similar to what HQ looks like, but I think for now I just have these downloaded um, places. Um, downloaded, because they're really cool too, but I'll just have these downloaded places for now. Anyways, we're going to go back to HQ. And we're going to go ahead and play as those characters. And see how far we get. We still got... Five minutes. Oh no. <laughs> we're not going to have very much time. Maybe I should set another 30 minutes. I think I will once the timer goes off, because I don't think that was enough time at all, and I think an hour would be better, so. I don't think we're ever going to load.
like I said, I should probably set it for another 30 seconds. So it's at least a little bit longer. Hopefully it won't uh, not let me upload the video because it's too large or something. Seems like Penny is training and start your gadgets on the computer. Um, Chief One B is also on the computer. There's a thunderstorm? But it's super sunny out. It doesn't seem like that much of a thunderstorm to me. Oh, I just build the ball really quick. Stranger danger. He keeps talking to that little robot type. <laughs> Hey, watching TV, uh, watching Civic Public Ass Access. What? There's a boy. The robot's scary, apparently. Well, if I can help it, uh, too late. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure what to do the rest of this part. Anyways. Yeah, that'd be good. Can't friends with brain. That's good. You've the Papa. Also, very cute. To Nova. In dark. Everyone's very tense because of the thunderstorm. You're it. That reminds me. I should probably. Maybe in another video is get the get the storm the storm uh, I forget the storm machine and for mad and they should like try to mess with the uh, where's the fridge um they should probably mess with the like. The weather, like they kind of did in that one episode. <laughs> oh, 
Uh-oh. Okay, 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 okay. I got it. I will reset it to 30 again because I think I want to have it a little longer. Maybe we should... Okay. That wasn't scary. Kayla asked Inspector Gadget. Well, no one has parenting skills, so... Um, I want to grow up, and my friends haven't figured out what should I pick something you like. I'm gonna go ahead and... I don't know. I don't really know where we should travel, because I don't think... There's not much to do, but I guess we'll go ahead and go and just um, change my shumu. <laughs> change my sh I don't know why I can't say it anymore. I don't know why I can't say it right now. Sand my shumo. Okay, there we go. Um, where should we visit? I guess I could add celebrities to, like, later, like, the, uh, random celebrities they have in, um, the 2015 show, just because it'd be kind of interesting, like, uh, I can't forget, I forgot what they were, but <laughs> who cares, maybe I shouldn't. I was talking about like that um one actor guy that is like super buff like in that one episode and like Inspector Gadget really <laughs> like that character for some reason. I don't know. Because he was a celebrity or something. I can't remember. Did you guys already start your club meeting? Oops. Um nope. Well, let's just go ahead and start it anyways. It's too bad you can't add animals to, like, clubs. Like, they could be the mascot or something. Or something. I don't know. I mean, I know Mad could do it. Because Mad Cat is the mascot. Um, so, NHQ is be friendly to everyone. Work out. Maybe I should have went to the gym then and play chess. Because, I, I don't know, I just thought these were kind of police-like things. But I'm not really sure what else they could do in this club. So, yeah. Other than watch out for mad agents and what they're planning, I guess. Now, there's a protest. I guess we could go ahead and investigate this and see. Well, as long as it's peaceful, right? <laughs> Oh, okay. maybe we should go somewhere else. <laughs> it's pretty peaceful. I don't know. What we could do here is probably do karaoke or... Not really sure. Penny seems to still be getting it. Um, something about is that a simoleon and percentage? Something. Right. Like that. And there's a slug. Yeah, it must be a good cause. Oh, <laughs> 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 
I don't really see. Is that who I think it is? Hold on. Dr. Claw fucking with the robot toilet thing. Okay, he's gotta be planning something. I know, I'm trying to do this like. Okay, he's ordering a drink. Okay, we got some kind of fame. Oh, it's because we joined on the cause of I don't know. I just feel like I should do this. But what's their problem? <laughs> I guess something happened. I don't know. Sometimes my townies greet each other angrily for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know who I should go ahead and investigate Dr. Claw, but maybe they just leave it as them not knowing. <laughs> I wish I could control Brain. Maybe he could. I don't know. He seems very interested in the very interested in the violin right now. Sorry if I'm not talking loud enough. My Sims game seems to be. Okay. Okay, it's not really doing anything. Also, I gave Matt a symbol that was like a, like a cat because I couldn't really find anything. I have like more symbols for clubs, but they I didn't really have anything that could fit Matt that well except the this kitty cat that's like, yeah. <laughs> so... And for um, HQ, I just did a police symbol because, yeah. Oh. <laughs> okay, I think they're done. I think I want to bring them to the gym, but maybe we should have somebody investigate. Um, welcome HQ. Member. Okay. I think. All right. Darko. Up, oh, Doctor Claw left. Where is he? Maybe he just left. I think we should go ahead and go to. Him. First, let me have everyone take care of their needs. I think this is the... Uh, no, it's not. This is the men's room. Okay. I should have known. Um, somebody was... Okay, everyone needs to go to the bathroom. I think there's probably more bathrooms at the gym, so just go ahead and take them.
I was like drawing a blank there. I forgot. What am I going to do? Oh, yeah, right. The gem. <laughs> I wish I could have like both the clubs be enabled at the same time. I think I can. I just have to like maybe like another part, but go ahead and start that again and have everyone's needs get sorted out. You go make a thing. Um, you go ahead and use the bathroom. You go ahead and use the bathroom. And you go ahead and use the bathroom. There's another protest. Hopefully it's peaceful. Oh, oof, no, Wally King. And so gadget. Oh, um, there's a celebrity out here. Oh, sorry, didn't mean to do that. Okay, let's go and deploy base basketball. <laughs> I think everyone's going to play basketball. We should go ahead and have them go home. And I think the next day we'll go ahead and play as um, Dr. Claw and Talon. If we are ever going to get home. I'm going to go ahead and let everyone do what they want to do. Oh yeah, I forgot. Go ahead and have everyone clean the bed. Okay. 
it was chatting. Um, then he's browsing the web. Presses one sixteen presses browsing the web. Oh, such a mistake. Looks like the guy just playing with the robot oh. again. Wow, Rosta. What a noise! I forgot. Oh, uh, Quimby's um eating a hamburger. I think everybody should probably change out up there. It's like the gadget because our duel. <laughs> Actually, I don't really know what else to do. No one's very tired. Let's chat with Professor Bonson. What? What's the problem? I don't know why my sons do that. They treat each other very angry. I don't know why. Narfa. Shibi. Chabina. That's what they call Dalga. Ugh. Joking about something. How about we go ahead and talk to Kayla for a while? Where is Kayla? Oh, are they? What's Kayla doing? React first. Oh, okay. I don't know what's snowing. It's spring, but it's snowing. Oh, oh, lava, huh? Shibes. Yeshla. Uh huh. Renishu. Shushtuba. Kweba. Yebs. Grinnea, <laughs> Yathruya Rolshba, Quexanaz, Queba Vimps Ziffle, Yalig Mubna, <laughs> Nabatani, Hey, <laughs> Bruce, Huh, Ah, Uh huh, Sorry, I've been talking that much. <laughs> that is. I think people are going to bed soon. A uh, funny story. Ah, uh? <laughs> oh, canoe. Ah. Uh. Grabble Hina. Himna Vazib. Ah. Uh? Grabble Hina. I also have the height, mo uh, the height slide on. So that's why, like. Brapna. Some are taller than Bazoom. others. <laughs> inja, Inja. Javi! Pleva Zarps! Huh? Hey, you. Go ahead and have everybody go to bed. Oh, also, this was in the, the house already, so. Um, I don't know if we should, uh, Get rid of that and wait until he can build that, or if it's just fine to keep that there. Just wanted to ask. I went for like for Professor Von Sixteen to build it. Um, where's the bed? Okay, there it is. And then I think this one belongs to you, and Quimby's already asleep. Uh, Professor Von 16. 
I don't really want that. Sorry. I'm sorry. I know you wanted coffee, but... I hope Brain's okay. Um, I think he is. Um, he didn't really ask to go outdoors or... Um, anything else, so I don't really know. Don't really know. He's got a toy ball. Oh, brains traits. I'm so sorry. Um, he is smart, independent, and sleuth. I'm going to go ahead and let them do whatever they need to do. And we're going to switch to the Dr. Qual and Talon household or whatever. Let's just call it the Mad household um, for now. I'm not really sure what we're going to do. Maybe cause some mischief and mayhem and maybe I'll have them like um have Dr. Claw tell Talon to break into HQ for some reason or try to break into HQ and destroy Inspector Gadget but won't really actually be able to destroy Inspector Gadget. Y you know how the formula goes. Um if you watch the episodes <laughs> You know what I mean, right? I don't know. <laughs> I guess I didn't really explain the whole series, but I just don't really feel like it, but yeah. Basically, MAD is a criminal organization, and HQ, well not HQ, Inspector Gadget is one of the main characters, but he's like um, kind of a comic relief character, um, and uh, mostly Penny so, like um, stops MAD the mm -hmm. most, even though Inspector Gadget gets the credit um, kind of thing. I, I, that's all I think. Anyways, and Inspector Gadget is, like I said, a cyborg that has all these gadgets and things. And yeah, that's just the basic of it. <laughs> oh, there's another TV down here. I'm so dumb. I could have used this TV right here, but I guess I didn't realize there was one. Oh, well. Todd's watching in, um, a world co culture network. I thought it was the cooking channel for a sec. Watch your clothes browsing, browsing the web. I do have the school mod on, but I don't have a school right now but I could use that if you guys want me to use that um yeah he's probably gonna ask Talon if he yeah he's probably gonna have to go to school isn't he dang it 
I think we're going to go ahead and take it off for today. Then again, the others won't be around. I'm not really sure. I think we'll try to... I don't really know. <laughs> I guess I could make it a holiday and I would have them off, but... I don't know. I better think fast. Because she has to go to school in two hours. I'm gonna go ahead and have him take a vacation day. Nagula Shonen Yamagoku Perpa Chalif is Beniba Well Pator Away Spin do Okay, I'm trying to go there is a one from Christmas one. Okay, so he's eating granola right now. Um, I want to talk to him and tell him, uh, I guess whatever evil plan. I don't know what they were, what they're supposed to do today. I guess. Where are you going? You're going to troll the farms. Yeah, I figured you would. Okay, we're gonna stop eating that. Where'd it go? I don't know where it went. Disappearing bowl. I don't have time to figure that out. Let me see if I... I think I totally forgot how to open these. I really did. I totally forgot how to open them. Oh well, we'll figure it out later. I didn't have him go here, <laughs> and, hmm, friendly, I'll miss you. Let's go ahead and discuss evil plans. This is how I'll go for now, I don't know. Oh, well, that's out of character. Bounce you for me. Stoomsay Galarga. He fun now. Brett new sill boy. I need you to Nibu. break into HQ and. Well, I don't really know what this sort of plan is, but I need you to break into HQ. I'm not even doing the Dr. Claw voice. I am so so but I can't do a Dr. Claw voice. I need you to break into HQ and I need you to I need you to Yeah, this is terrible. I should stop. Um Uh anyways. I I don't know. Yeah. I need you to try to destroy Inspector Gadget or something. I don't know. <laughs> but anyways, I'm gonna have... And he's just like, okay, fine. <laughs> um, Talon's like, okay, fine. Um, oh, well, that's the end of the part. I'm sorry for that ridiculousness. Um... But apparently, we'll have to try to break into HQ in the next part. And, well, it's actually, there's 18 or 19 seconds on the timer, but, um, 
yeah, I guess that will be the end of this part. And we'll try to break in, we'll have Talon try to break in HQ, the next part. Not really break in, we'll see what we can do. Um, anyways, I thought it was kind of fun. Sorry for the hor horrible impression of, like, just trying to do <laughs> Dr. Claw's voice there. Um, but anyways, I thought this was pretty fun, and we'll see what I can do in the next part. Um, let me get to, back to action so I can go ahead and turn it off. Sorry, my phone keeps going off. I should just turn it off. Um, and yeah, we're going to stop it there. Bye.